Welcome to your seventh installment of Tell Em Alejandro, your number one place for sports, cars, video games, and fitness. If you're a man, you're here. Mr. Alejandro about to tell him. What you about to tell him, Alejandro? I'm about to tell y'all about that Christmas game last night, Golden State Warriors and Los Angeles Clippers. Tell him, Alejandro! That last Christmas game last night was so poppin'. It was the best game of all five games with no questions asked. The Clippers lost to the Warriors by two points in Golden State last night, 105 to 103. A few notable stats. Blake Griffin for the, the All-Star, big man for the Clippers, had a double-double, 20 points, 14 boards, 5 assists, 2. Shout out to him. He was also 4 for 6 from the free throw line. We all know he can't shoot free throws, so shout out to him. DeAndre Jordan had a nice big double-double, 13 points, 13 rebounds, 6 blocks. I would know I have him on my fantasy team. My squad is up. Jamal Crawford had 19 points. You know, he's nice. He could dribble. He can cross over, do all that good stuff. CP3 at 26 points, 11 Assists and two steals. A few notable stats for the Warriors. David Lee had a double double, 23 points, 13 assists. Andrew Bogut had another had a double double also, 10 points, 14 boards. Steph Curry, all-star point guard, 15 points, 6 boards, 11 assists. Klay Thompson had a monster game statistically and with the eye test. He had 23 points, 5 rebounds, 4 assists, 2 steals, 2 blocks. One of those two blocks came in crunch time against all-star point guard for the Clippers, Chris Paul. Now, let me get into some juicy stuff throughout the game. Blake Griffin, all-star big man for the Clippers, was ejected from the game. He picked up two technical fouls. I really want to talk about his second technical foul because I'm upset about it. He should not have been kicked out of the game. Let me break this down for you. Andrew Bogut, Golden State Warriors center, grabbed, his, grabbed, grabbed Blake Griffin's jersey. He tried to pull his jersey over his head, and by him getting hemmed up, basically, and herbed up, the referees kicked him out of the game. I can't believe that. You would think if he retaliated, if he cussed or snuffed Bogut or something, then, you know, he would get kicked out. But no, he got kicked out for absolutely nothing. This happened in the fourth quarter with 10 minutes and 43 seconds left, and it changed the whole game around. If you take a star from another team, that's going to mess up that team. And then to have that go down when he didn't even do anything, them referees are definitely suspect for that. I was looking at them salty the whole, the rest of the game, and I was rooting for the Clippers. Because I wanted them to win. And, you know, I felt like the referees was going against them. Now, as the game was going, coming out to an end, the crowd was into it. Golden State Warriors games are always extremely exciting. Because the crowd is so into it. Shout out to Oakland. They be putting in, that crowd puts in work. I like that crowd. Now, as the game's coming, to, come, coming down to an end, the game is tight. It's like a one-point game. They're going at it. Steph Curry's going at Chris Paul. Chris Paul's going at uh, Steph Curry. Chris Paul was matched up with Andrew Bogut. And he's just crossing them up, bam, bam, hitting them with the street moves, the street court moves, jaying them in his eyes and all that. I was like, oh, no, this is crazy. But it came down to Chris Paul missing a layup and Jamal Crawford missing a shot. And the, at the close of seconds of the game, it's a shame that the Clippers lost. I wanted them to win after Blake got ejected for nothing. But it was a good game. A lot of banging down low in the paint. A lot of hard fouls, flagrant fouls, technical fouls. And if you missed it, you suck. The nice green and silky bow tie is brought to you by Countess Mara. It's an Italian men's warehouse. Get your weight up, not your hate up. Straight up. Tune in for more sports, cars, video games, fitness, and all that. Outro music. I don't even want to dance tonight. I'm feeling elegant. I'm about to just chill. Drink my TEA. Y'all feel it? I couldn't resist. That beat goes hard.